I mean, Davis Cup for me is, is one of the most important events um, that I can play uh, in my career. I would love to win one, but obviously I'm a massive fan of the team environment. Uh, I love getting out there with the team and, and getting behind you know everyone that I'm close with and, and trying to get the win for the, for the country, obviously. But just that whole week, you know, building chemistry with 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 a team, and you know, I just I, I literally love playing for, for someone other than myself for once. And uh, Leighton Hewitt, your captain, uh, how is he uh, in that role, and what has he? given you in that experience? Yeah, Rusty's helped me a lot. Um, I think he's the best captain we've ever had. Um, I know that everyone on our team would run through a brick wall for him. So, you know, he's been unbelievable support for me. Um, you know, there have been times this year where I haven't been, you know, doing too well mentally and he's obviously always been there and Davis Cup's done wonders for me this year. Um, it's really, it's made me, you know, find that love again for for just, just being, with the, being with the guys and, and just having some fun and just knowing that tennis isn't all bad, you can have some fun with it. So you're heading to Brussels to play Belgium in the semifinals. Uh, talk a little bit about your expectations. Yeah, I think um, you know I think our team's feeling good. Um, you know, in a way, we played a great time Brisbane against uh, the United States a couple months ago, and uh, we've always been looking forward to this. We've always stayed in contact. We're, uh, we haven't forgot about it. So I think you know that week together, building that chemistry is going to be important. So this is your first away tie this year. Uh, how will that change the dynamic a little bit for the team? Yeah, it's going to change the dynamic. Um, obviously, playing in Australia, it's one of the most supportive home crowds you can get. You know, they really get behind you, and, and it can really change the atmosphere. And you know, I'm not I'm not really too sure what to expect in Brussels. You know, I'm sure the crowd will be very one-sided, but at the same time, I assume the atmosphere will be really incredible. Are you expecting any of the Australians to show up? It's a big trip. Yeah, of course, there'll, there'll be Australians there for sure. Um, it's not, you know, it's once every blue moon that, you know, you get a semi-finals of Davis Cup and we have a real chance to win it. So I think it's uh, this year is our best chance we've had in a long, long time. Obviously, it's been a long time since the Davis Cup has been home in Australia. Obviously, just the semi-finals right now. But what would it mean for you to be a part of a winning effort and bring that cup home? Yeah, again? just thinking about it, you know, it brings me so much excitement. I've put it as, you know, honestly my top priority to, to be healthy, to, to fight and, and to really, you know, get some really good results in Davis Cup and, you know, I just want to share it with those guys. I want to share the, the victory and I want to, you know, to take home the trophy that day with the boys would be, you know, probably a dream come true for me. Um, obviously, I'm just a massive fan of team sports and that's the closest thing we have to it in, in tennis.